Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. In this video, I have a Dollar Tree DIY for Halloween. For starters, you will need a Dollar Tree doormat. You will also need one of the um, Dollar Tree scarves that has like the black and orange buffalo check. I actually picked up two because I wasn't sure how many I was going to need. I only ended up using one. Also, you will need your hot glue gun and some paint of your choice. I chose an orange. Um, I had two different types, but one of them was actually going out, so I ended up using just the acrylic orange. You will also need some sort of stencil of a pumpkin, which is totally optional, but you'll see what I do with this towards the end. And let's get started. So for starters, I'm going to just measure out the scarf on the ends and cut it down the middle so that way I can just use one scarf for the parameter of the doormat. Now that I have it all nice and cut, I'm going to just glue it on the back side of the doormat, I'm trying to keep it as even as possible with like the buffalo check. Now that I have all the sides glued down, I flip my mat back over and I'm using this little small pumpkin um, stencil just to outline the pumpkin shape. I'm just using a regular old Sharpie marker just to outline the shape and I'm gonna make a small jack-o'-lantern in the bottom corner. This is totally optional you don't even have to do this part but i thought it would be really cute to put a little jack-o-lantern in there even though my drawing skills are not the greatest um it still turned out pretty good So now I'm just gonna fill in my pumpkin with that orange paint I showed you guys earlier. This is just an acrylic paint um, that I got from Walmart for about 99 cents. I started using a paintbrush and quickly realized that I probably should use a sponge and it actually worked a lot better.
Once I was done with the pumpkin, I realized that I kind of wanted to paint over the welcome sign with the orange also. It was like this really weird yellow color. You can't really tell in the video because the quality isn't that great. But um, I just went over the welcome sign with the orange acrylic paint also. I'm really happy that I decided to go over the welcome sign with the orange acrylic paint. It just made it stand out a little bit more. I'm really happy how this turned out for $2 for our front porch. Um, I have a lot of Halloween decor that I'll be pulling out, so make sure you guys hit the subscribe button. I'll do a small video on how I styled our front porch and how I do our hot cocoa bar for Halloween. Thank you guys for watching.